Auto Line at CES is brought to you by Borg Warner, ETOS, and by Gentex. So, George, tell me about Comma AI, what all you're doing here. Very interesting that you're retailing autonomy, like very simply and very inexpensively. Mm -hmm. Tell me how you're doing it. So we make this box for less than we sell it for. And then we sell the box, and then you put the box in your car, and then it drives the car for you. <laughs> I'm sure there's a little bit more to it than that. No. No. You got to plug so, it in. You got to plug the box in. This is the whole thing. Yeah. Right here, that's all of it. Yeah. And you're making this in the US. Yeah, San Diego. Unreal. You didn't decide to outsource it uh, overseas or anything like that, huh? I mean, the, yeah, in huge volumes, it probably makes sense. We, we've sold about 20,000 of these devices. Uh, yeah, so 20,000, let's say I could save 40 bucks a device by going overseas. Okay, that's $800,000. It's not the highest priority. Okay, uh, you're announcing a new lower price here. At CTS, we are right, a thousand bucks for this. Thousand bucks, nine ninety nine. That's pretty impressive. Nine ninety nine has always been the dream. Nine ninety nine and twenty four dollars a month. Uh, this month is month is completely optional. It totally works without the subscription too. Okay, but, uh, so you said you've sold about twenty thousand. I'm sure <laughs> your ambition is a whole lot more than that. Yeah, yeah, twenty thousand a year would be nice. That's that's a good ambition. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'd be happy with 20000 a year. Really? You, you, you think you can make a go of it at, at that kind of volume? I mean, why not go for millions? Um, millions of units, that is. Millions of units is fine. I mean, our mission is to solve self-driving cars, and the question is, how do we build a sustainable company on the way to doing that? Mm -hmm. So you can look at the space, and the space is a graveyard. My crews just shut down, right? Right, right. Literally, if you, if you wasted less than $8 billion, you're richer than GM. Like, uh, it's, it's, it's just crazy. Um, so, you know, our, our philosophy is kind of like, build slowly and just make sure you're making positive progress every day and eventually you'll solve self-driving cars and win. Um, so yeah, I mean, are, is there a market for millions of these? I think the total market for these is maybe like a million. Yeah, I think we can capture it. I mean, 100,000 a year would be better. Like, yeah. I, I'm saying 20,000 a year short term, and then I think we can get up to 100,000 a year. So what would you describe this? Level three, level four, or what? I don't think the levels make much sense. I think the best thing to think about is time between disengagements. So that's time between when you have to take an action. Um, so on the highway, we are over an hour between requiring an action, basically. So you, you monitor the driver, they got to pay attention. Mm -hmm. I, I, yeah, excuse my ignorance on this, but uh, you know, I know a little bit about it. So it's a driver assistance system, um, meaning that it assists the driver, doesn't replace the driver. So the driver needs to be paying attention and ready to take over at all times. Now, you're like, okay, but wait, why do I want that? Um, why do you want cruise control? But then like, instead of cruise control, why does cruise control, why would cruise control ram into the car in front of me if he stops? Why doesn't the cruise control stop? And then like, why do I have to still turn the wheel when I'm using cruise control? And with Kama, you don't have to do any of those things. Wow, so how do you patch into a system that you even can do the steering? Um, so most cars made after 2016 have electronic power steering, uh, meaning there's already a motor on the steering wheel, so you can just send a message over the CAN bus. It's different for different cars, but not that different. Um, most cars, like cars don't make their own steering, they go with a bunch of tier one suppliers, Bosch, Continental, Delphi, you understand how they all work, and then, yeah. yeah. And it's a camera-based system that uh, allows you essentially hands off, eyes off? Uh, hands off, eyes on. Eyes uh, on, okay. Yes. So you need to be paying attention and ready to take over at all times, uh, but you do not need to have your hands on the wheel. I mean, that's your personal preference. Uh, we do not enforce hands, we do enforce, it's not exactly eyes on the road, it's are you ready to take over the car? And it's an end-to-end -end model that determines that. And, and you got a bunch of car brand logo, so we it, do. it'll work on all of these, huh? Uh-huh. Um, we support 300 uh, different cars. So you can go to comma.ai and you can look at the compatibility list. Um, the only thing that's different between cars is this harness. So you can see this is a Toyota A harness. Um, it's really easy on our website. You just select the car from a dropdown and we'll send you the right connector. Um, it installs in realistically 15 minutes. Um, you can do it in a minute if you're rushing, but take your time, you know, be careful, it's an expensive car. But yeah, no, it's super easy. It's just this one wire you have to plug in. So have car companies approached you and said, hey, dude, let's, uh, let's do it, you know? Uh... 
okay. at a higher scale. Okay, so they might say that, and then what? What happens? Then they take it over. Well, so, you know, car companies may have approached me to buy the company, but, you know, I heard from Kyle Vogt that GM is a bunch of dummies. You see what happens when you sell to GM, you fail, right? So why would I want to sell to GM, right? Um, there's an approach from car companies that would work for us, which is, see this? We want you to make this in a different box and we want to buy 100,000 of them. All right, now we're talking, right? And send that in the first email. Don't send me, you know, and they will. They all will. Uh, but, you know, you, you got to do it like that. Because the minute you start going into like big partnerships, they, it's much cheaper for them to waste your time than it is for you to waste theirs. Overseas, you see an overseas market for this? We sell worldwide. No uh, kidding. We'll sell anywhere. It's very popular in Taiwan and South Korea. Very interesting. Uh, Taiwan, South Korea, Japan, uh, big markets. I mean, okay, obviously like our second biggest market is Canada. Uh, and our biggest market is US, but yeah. Cool, thanks for your time, Matt. Sure. Re really cool stuff. Thanks. thanks. The automotive industry continues to evolve, and so do the opportunities to define it. Borg Warner, one of the world's most admired companies, gets its partners where they need to go. Let's do something big, together.